there in the ninth inning, two on, one out. What's your approach in that situation when you step into the batter's box? Uh, just get the job done. You know, I, great at bat by, uh, you know, Gio to get us started in that inning. And then, you know, I had a good view of uh, DJ's, you know, basically the right field. You know, a lot of pitches this, uh, today I was just kind of pulling off and not really staying through it in the middle of the field. So just kind of seeing a nice, good swing from DJ right there kind of locked me in and um, decided to come up big. You mentioned the walk to Gio, but just knowing that the top of the order is going to be coming up, you'd most likely be getting in at bat. Does, do you have all the confidence in the world that you guys can get something going offensively in that spot? Yeah, yeah, we're never out of the game. You know, we're, we're never out. We're just, um, with, with this offense we have, with guys that can, you know, get on base and guys with some power, you know, it doesn't matter if it's a one-run lead, two-run lead, three-run lead for the team. I think we always got a shot going in every inning. So, uh, you know, I was looking forward to it that inning. Aaron, how do you kind of sum up this road trip? Great. You know, we're playing baseball. We're, we're getting it started. You know, there's really no other way to, to say it. You know, there's a lot of things going on in the world, but, you know, to be able to play some baseball and you know, be back with the guys and be back with you guys is, uh, is something special. And we're, you know, just excited for the start of it and you know, can't wait for the rest of the year. Thanks, Aaron. We'll take the next one from Bruce Beck. Aaron, are you looking forward to going home for the home opener, even without fans knowing you're going back to your own ballpark? Yeah, Bruce, we're looking forward to it. You know, we always, this team loves to play in New York, so we're excited about that. But uh, it's definitely going to be different with the uh, Yankee home opener with no fans. That's one thing I always look forward to every single year is that place gets rocking on opening day for us. And, um, you know, doing the intros, introductions, everything like that. It's um, it's something special. So we're, we're definitely, it's definitely going to be different, but we're just looking forward to, I think, sleeping in our own beds and being at home. And buses are leaving shortly, so we have time for two more. Take the next one from Marley Rivera. Aaron, what is it about um, this ballpark where you guys perform so well? These are 18 uh, consecutive wins uh, also for you guys against the Orioles. It's just, I think it's just a hitter's friendly park. You know, you guys saw that tonight, you know, with, you know, majority of the runs coming off of uh, home runs and you know, they got a short, you know, short fence in left center and right center. And it's just, you get it up in the air, it's usually going to have a pretty good chance of getting out, especially with the arms they have and how, you know, how hard they throw and, you know, the good stuff they have, even with our guys, they throw hard too. So it's just, you know, when you guys, you got hard throwing guys you're going up against, usually the ball kind of travels a little farther. So it's uh I don't know. It's, I think it's usually a lot of Yankee fans as we travel here too, you know, so we're missing out on them, but um, you know, we just love playing here. Thank you. Hold on. And we'll take the last one from Pete Caldera. Aaron, just a little bit off that, uh, just what's kind of that moment like where it's a big spot, you've got the, the count in your advantage and, uh, you know, instead of hearing the a crowd, you, you, you're just hearing your teammates, you know, there on, on the bench, just a few feet away from you. What, what's that moment like there? Everyone's special, you know, it's still, you know, fans or no fans, this game is something special and beautiful. And, you know, those little moments like that kind of big for your team are, are huge. So, you know, I was just fortunate enough to be in that spot. You know, I struck out my last at bat before that. And, um, you know, just knew this was my time to come up and, you know, forget about the past and come up big for my teammates. You know, they were counting on me and it's times like that you got to get the job done.